are competitive athletics meaningless? Well, you know, it's a funny question for me to be asking if you've uh, ever interacted with me, but it's certainly something I've asked myself. I feel like it's pretty clear what the meaning behind recreational athletics is. You got fun, health, friends, and a ton of other stuff. So why take it a step further? It could be about a scholarship or making a living, but I feel like that isn't the primary motivating factor for most competitive athletes, or, and a lot of people can't relate to that, so it can't be the crux of it. Now, obviously you don't have to play sports at a high level for them to be fun. It is worth mentioning that for some people they are more fun that way. However, as you become more and more serious in competitive sports, you're gonna have to question the value of fun because you're gonna start doing things that aren't fun. And when you bring up questions like that, a lot of people start looking for deeper things to attach meaning to. Personally, when I ask questions like that, the first thing that comes to mind for me is being passionate. So is being passionate the point? Well, why does it matter if I can succeed at arbitrary tasks? Why does it matter if I can put a 29 half inch ball through a hoop that happens to be 10 feet in the air or win a game with a particular set of rules? Well, I think it matters because when you find something that you wanna do, try it, fail at it, and still wanna try time and time again, you clearly care about that thing. And for a lot of people, it's very rare to find things that they actually care about. So you caring is the meaning because you care enough to prioritize that thing. You clearly, it clearly matters. You clearly care about it, at least in my opinion. And I don't think it's worth looking too much more into why you care. It's like, if I asked you whether you like the color blue or yellow and you say blue, like, am I going to be like, oh, why did you pick blue? Does it matter? <laughs> you know, does it actually like, you know, you just, you just pick blue. You like blue. But what if other people don't care about what you care about or it doesn't matter to anyone or help anyone? Well, you can't actually control that. You can't just pick and choose what to care about. And if you're looking for more meaning than whatever you're currently finding in your sport, as long as your motivation is pure, I think a lot of people end up finding that meaning along the way, or at least myself and a lot of other people have. In my own internal dialogue, I've made arguments like, oh, well, you can have fun doing anything and sports is gonna take away from other parts of your life. However, I feel like that you could have fun doing anything one is just silly. And there's plenty of examples of people doing great things in other parts of their life. So I'm really not a fan of that all or nothing mentality. You know, uh, it's good in, good in moderation, but even if it's as simple as I like it, uh, that's actually a good answer. It's kind of the point I've been trying to get across this whole video is just accepting that is, is fair. I know it's like tough for a three word sentence to dictate how you're gonna spend a big portion of your life. But you know, I, I'd like a three page mission statement plus randomized control trial, peer reviewed qualitative study, man. But you know, we don't, that, that's not realistic. So yeah, I, I'd love to hear what everyone else thinks. Also, if you could think competitive athletics are meaningless, that is totally fair. <laughs> Honestly, I don't, I don't have the answers. 